Lizard Lizard Nation. Nation. I'm Joel Perez. And I'm Brianna Monroe. And And you're you're watching watching BGTV. BGTV. Here are the announcements for the week. The final meeting for the Mentors in Violence Prevention Program has been rescheduled for Monday, February 1st in room 144. The New York Army Academy Guard will have an information table set up during lunches on Tuesday, February 2nd for students interested in speaking with them. For any seniors interested in showcasing their talents, there will be a senior showcase meeting on Monday in the middle cafeteria. If you're interested in community service hours, Recycling Club meets every Friday in room 231. And now, here's Nick with with sports. sports. Thanks, guys. On Friday the 22nd, the indoor track team won the division championship meet in West Point. The girls put up 194 points. Senior Shannon Thompson broke her own personal record in the 1,000-meter run by 10 seconds. Cheyenne Lewis took first place in her event, the shot put. A huge congratulations to the track team. Next, I'm going to talk to Player of the Week, Paul Catalano, not only about his achievements, but about the team itself. Thanks, guys. I'm here with Player of the Week, Paul Catalano. Hey, Paul, how are you? I'm good, Nick. How are you? Good. So, you run track. What made you want to do track as a sport? Uh, at first, I just took it as a way to just stay in shape for baseball. But as I like progressed and got better at it, I decided to just stick with it and do events and get better. So, you guys had a huge meet on Friday, division championship. What, it, what was the atmosphere like? Tell me some more about it. The atmosphere was impeccable. It was really just amazing. We worked really hard, put us over Warwick, beat them by 16 points, and it was the first time we beat them in eight years. That's really good. How did you do yourself? Um, I, I PR'd in two of my races out of three, and I came in second place in all three of my races, so it was a pretty good day. Didn't you run a back-to-back races? How did that feel like mentally? Um, yeah, I ran back-to-back races. I just tried to just help my team win and give them the chance they deserve to win the division. Is there anybody on the team that you can highlight for doing good? Like, Yeah, Aaron Sastry. He had a great race on um, Friday, and he helped us put us over Warwick. All right, thank you. I'm Nick. I'm Paul. See you next time. Hi, Angelina here with BGTV. I'm currently with... Rosanna. Malia. Allie. Okay, so we're standing right now outside of their pro- propaganda project. So can you tell me exactly what the project was? Well, the propaganda project was basically, we read a book called Animal Farm, which was based on the Russian Revolution and Joseph Stalin's rule. And basically the project was to take the book Animal Farm, recreate it with our own ideas and with our own characters. So so what exactly was your project? Um, Our project was to recreate and do Walt Disney, like old and original Walt Disney. So Mickey, Minnie, Donald, Daisy, um, and the whole point of our skit was that we were overthrowing Walt Disney's here with Max, Alex, James. And we are right now outside of their propaganda project. So specifically, what was your project? Um, our project was about a society that moves to a new planet. And uh, in this new planet, there's a bunch of power struggles. And um, there's also natives on the planet. And the people struggle to take over and maybe get rid of the natives. So. All right, thank you. Angelina signing off for BGTV. Look at what she's wearing. You're great just the way you are. Even though No Name Con Week ended last week, it really is every week. Words are powerful, so be careful with what you say. Take a stand against bullying and always remember the golden rule. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Thanks for watching. I'm Joe Perez. And I'm Brandon Monroe. See See you next time. time.